everyone welcome back to equal family today we are going to see about one of the most asked sql entry question in delight let's see what is the question and what is the answer for that i have a two input table one is on table having product information like product id product name and category information and another table having total sales revenue based on each year wise so i want output like this format that means i want to find out the product whose sales increased every year that means example the product id 1 2020-2090 the revenue is 1000 and 2020 revenue is 1200 and 2021 revenue is 1100 same way product 2 500 600 and 900 see product 2 uh, total sales of each every year is increased but remaining product sometimes it is increased and sometimes it is decreased so i want the output like this format which which product every year constantly increased sales total sales revenue so let's see how we can achieve this result so now i'm going to create a table the table called products that having product id primary key column and product name and category let's create this table so table created now i'm going to insert a few records like a laptops electronic item jeans clothing item and chairs home appliance items so now i'm going to insert the records in product table records are inserted now i am again i am going to create a, another table that is called sales that table having product id and year and total sales revenue i am using decimal of two digits i want uh, after dot two digits so primary key is product id and i am referring this product product ID in product table as well that is called as a foreign key so now I am going to create a table sales tables created now I am going to insert a few records for product ID 1 19 20 19 20 20 and 2021 few values and 2022 product 2 2019 uh, 2020 and 2021 so like this way I am going to insert a few records in sales table so records are inserted now let's see what are the records are stored in both table product and sales so now now we have uh, two tables the product table and say, uh, total sales revenue table now what is the question to find out every year sales increased which product which product sales is increased every year so now I'm using common table expression. So we need to compare e every year means we can use analytic function using la lead or lag function. So here I'm going to use lead function and lead function required three parameter. So what is the column? I'm using total sales revenue because I want uh, every year uh, revenue from next year. So I want to compare that column. That's why I'm using total sales using lead function. If uh, uh, it's a new, uh, numeric value means 1, otherwise uh, it will sh show same values. So our partition by, that means I want to make a group by, group by in that uh, an analytic function we can call as a partition by. So product ID based, based on partition by and I am using order by every year. So that is called as next value. So let's see this select statement. Select store from city so every year uh, 2019 uh, 2019 total sales is 1000 for next value is 1200 for product 1 1200 for product 2 next value is 1100 for 1100 because we don't have next value so i make same value so same way remaining record records are uh, generated the next value using lead function so this part clear now i make i'm going to make a joint condition to get the product name and category detail so using select p dot product id that means p means product table so i'm using here joint condition with cte method so select product id category what are the columns i want i'm selected those columns from cte table inner joint product table so this common record between both table is product id this is the common column between both tables so here i am using uh, on condition c dot product id equal to p dot product id 
here I am using where condition for C dot product ID not in. That means I don't want total sales revenue uh, not consecutively increased values. Sorry, no, uh, it's a uh, I want consecutively increased total sales amount. That's why I am using greater than total sales revenue. So select product ID from CTE method. I want total sales revenue amount greater than next next value. That means let's see what is the output for this. See here the clothing is consecutively increase the value like 2019 500, 2020 600, 2021 900. That means the value sales total sales is consecutively increasing every year. So we got whatever the product ID for that sales and what is the category, what is the product name, on what, which year the values are increased. So we have achieved this result. Thank you all. Please subscribe our channel to get more information and please comment me if you have query related doubts or concept related doubts. Thank you all. Bye.